I'm John Barbosa, and you are watching Hypnotism 101. Thanks for tuning in. It's a new year, and for me and many of you, it's a time where we get to reflect on our accomplishments of the past year and to complete any of last year's unfinished goals and create and successfully complete new goals for the new year. In episode 16 titled, Keywords to Help You Successfully Accomplish Goals, I mentioned that one of my goals was to write five books before the end of the year. I completed two books, one called Barboza's Book of Hypnotic Inductions and Hypnosis Inductions Dissected, along with a booklet called Instant Self-Hypnosis Technique, which was available to everyone who attended my seminar at the 2022 National Guild of Hypnotists Convention. I fell short of completing the five books, but it was not in any way looked at as a failure. In fact, I'm in the process of publishing more books this year, along with completing many short-term and long-term goals that are on my to-do list. I mention this because I remember when I was working in a factory and a couple of my co-workers were talking about leaving the job and going back to school. The mere fact of them talking about bettering themselves and going back to school motivated me to leave what I considered to be a dead-end job and to better myself by going back to school. So perhaps you hearing me mention my accomplishments, my desires, my plans to do things that I'm thinking about doing will motivate you to do something that you've been thinking about doing. Maybe it's quitting smoking, dieting, returning back to school, changing jobs, or joining a gym. If you find yourself getting excited and motivated about what somebody else is doing or talking about, if your imagination begins to create a scenario of you happily doing something satisfying and rewarding, Play with it, examine it, and you may find that it's not that far-fetched of an idea, that it's attainable. I have accomplished many of my goals just by doing this. One day I told myself I'm going to make a music video, and I did. I took the necessary steps to figure out how to do it, and I did it one step at a time. Another time I said, I'm going to be a hypnotist. I searched for the hypnotist that I felt comfortable with, studied under him, and I became a hypnotist. When I decided to go back to school after being away for 10 years, I enrolled and I didn't stop going until I graduated. I had the drive, the motivation, the commitment, and I never allowed any thoughts of quitting to enter my mind. So take this moment to reflect on your accomplishments of last year and revisit your unfinished goals and examine any new ideas that come to mind and put them into action. And before you know it, you will realize that you are the master of your destiny and that you can be and do whatever your mind thinks. I'm John Barboza and this is Hypnotism 101.